It was revealed Wednesday morning that Roma's great captain, Francesco Totti, is set to retire at the end of this season. When I think of Totti, I think of the ultimate Roman gladiator. In the pantheon of great Italian players, Raymond, where is Francesco Totti for you? He's one of the immortals, certainly in Rome. Uh, they'll be tearing down the statues of Julius Caesar and replacing them with statues of Totti. Yeah. He's beloved uh, ever since he was a 10-year-old kid. He's been there. He decorated the football field. He never got the just uh, recognition in Europe, especially England, who looked at him as a, a luxury. But what's new there? He was a footballer beyond compare and uh, a brilliant, brilliant orchestrator, an entertainer, a lethal footballer. And uh, I think Rome has handled this one very, very well. James Pallotta has done brilliantly in smoothing out the tides. The, the manager's handled it well. The club's going to bring him into the fold uh, for the rest of his life. Yep. It is, it's a great end to a great, great, great player. But it's like uh, Pallotta said a few years ago, the new stadium should be there for Totti to play the very first uh, game. Yeah. And I think uh, the Roman politicians who kind of held it back have destroyed us that. But mm -hmm. he, I have a feeling he'll be there for the first kick. Yeah. It's okay. also a shame that uh, he doesn't get to be around for the Monchi era because yeah. you know something special is about to happen uh, yeah. with Roma. They've Aggressive just picked up the club. best sporting director, GM, whatever you like, yeah. in football, and I think he could have gotten the pieces around them as well.